Hey dudes, welcome back to RC Cars UK. Paddy with you here again. You can see we've got out the old Screaming Demons SD Slash. Sent to me by Gene Caretzi um, about a year ago or so I think now. Uh, it's had quite a few modifications over the years. It's sat neglected for the past month or so um, because I've just not had the time for having various things going on so anyway uh, moving on we're going to do the project so this is just part one so this is just the plan so what are we doing for this build um, I'm about to get started on it but I'm waiting on some parts so this is just basically the plan so we've got the slash obviously we've got a 18 CNC Durango Dex um, chassis on there all good what we're gonna have to do though is this middle shaft here the blue shaft um, I will... here we're going to have to get an X01 shaft, which is exactly the same spline pattern as this, I've been told, thankfully, by um, Celtic Carbon. So thanks very much for that, Facebook. So uh, the uh, X01 shaft is the same but longer. And the reason for that is we're going to build a 164 before. Uh, if you can just, obviously, uh, you'll have to excuse how crudely that's fitted. We're not a million miles away from uh, wheelbase, we're probably going to add an, on another 8-ish centimetres to that to get to the wheelbase that we desire. Um, obviously the spoiler and stuff will be coming off and stuff. Uh, but there you go, so uh, it's going to sit like, it's going to be sort of a street slash rally truck. It will be sitting a little up, I'm not going to have it sat down like that because obviously these tyres will balloon a little. Uh, so I will have it sat up a little bit. Uh, but it will look quite scale, hopefully we can give this a little paint job maybe as well. Um, but first job is going to be cutting this chassis in half, taking off the top brace here, cutting the chassis in half. And then after that, we've got to find this X01 shaft and get that in place. And then that's pretty much it. We've got a, a Racer Star 4068 kilovolt motor with a hardened, I think it's a 20 tooth pinion. We're going to need a new spare as well because the spare that I got almost instantly turned to mush on one section of it. I can find it. Where are you? Yeah, that there flattered it all out on one section, so uh, I'm going to have to get another uh, spare, unfortunately, and uh, get that in place as well for the new motor uh, and the 120 amp PSC. I'm going to run it on 4S, so that's the basic plan anyway. Um, so yeah, thanks very much for watching. Stick around for part two when we start chopping things up and getting things sized up. Thanks guys. <laughs> 